I, uh, I'm heading into Greystones, County Wicklow. I'm going down for a swim, but I also saw a sign there the last time I was here saying that there was an exhibition on, an open air exhibition. So I'm just gonna go and see, can I have a swim and have a look at the exhibition. You may know that Greystones Harbour has recently been developed and there's a lot of controversy about it. Part of the development though has been a plaza on the waterfront and today that plaza is home to an exhibition and a market. There's the man making chairs. There's the man making the children's puzzles. Then there's the retired school teacher whose pictures feature school children playing. And then there are three photographers who have things in common. They're all men and they all worked or work in IT. I've always done photography since I was a, a nipper, so, uh, you know, just, I love getting out. I, I'm one of these people who doesn't sleep too much, so I love getting out, out uh, before sunrise and get down, getting, getting the really good photographs, you know. What's the best photo you ever took? Ooh. It's a hard question. It's a very hard question. I mean, I think my, my most uh, popular one, I think, is the, the drum and trees here behind us, which is a local landmark. That would be certainly one of my favourite shots that I've taken, you know. As a hobby, I suppose, and taking photos for 20 years as such. Oh yeah. yeah. And these are all holiday photographs. This one is in Marrakesh in the old Islamic College, which is a tourist site now. It's also in Marrakesh here. Uh, we have Vermont. To a uh, friend playing uh, with the E Street Band, he was kind enough to get us very close to Bruce. Ah! The X has to go on it, because uh, <laughs> people have been too... Uh, free with their phones over the last few weeks. So, Because then they try and pass it off as their own? Well, it's just people feel, you know, they can post anything on Facebook, I suppose, and, you know, quality of phones are getting better and in the right light, I suppose, you know, somebody can reprint it and, you know, get the credit for it. So there's a lot of time and effort that goes into actually capturing the, the original image and printing it. So I think it's fair that the artist gets the credit for it. I take it as I see it. I see it, I take it. If it works, it works. And if it doesn't, well, it's next time, you know. Tell me the first photo you took that you said to yourself, that's good, that's, I'm happy now with what I'm doing. I've managed to achieve something with that. One of the ones is that one there. It's from South Africa, looking down onto the beach. And the minute I took it, I knew, looked at it and said, yeah, I like that. Uh, it was a friend of mine who bought a copy of it for me some years back. And he said, if you took the guy out of it, you wouldn't know if it was sea or what it was. Nice. You think there were clouds. And, you know, it's just that little bit, you know, different. Greystone's waterfront exhibition. Well, it's great looking at paintings and photographs. It's even better having the makers tell you about them. Where did the moustache come from? <laughs> <laughs> After quite a long time. It's it is it. fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> 